Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This customer is having this mobile mechanic fix some work that was apparently done by another mechanic. Whoever did the work did not align the struts so they drilled extra holes to make it work and wrapped wire around the bolts to try and get the bolts tight as the bolts were stripped. They had also installed a new water pump that seems to be leaking already and did a bunch of other damage in the process. A whole pool of coolant right there. And this customer brought on their car as they said they have water leaking onto their center console. The customer had just installed a hat rack in his car and installed it using these self tappers. Customer states the touchscreen is glitching and changes stations on his own. Also, the screen appears to be scratched. And this car was brought in as the customer said the new clutch his friend installed stopped working. Whoever installed the clutch dropped an extension and socket in the clutch, which damaged the transmission and clutch assembly. And this car was brought in as the customer says his exhaust is leaking oil. The mechanic found that the customer had this jug of oil in the trunk that was leaking engine oil. This car was brought in as the customer says they have a leak at the rear of the vehicle. The mechanic found one of these jugs of water to be the issue. Customer states the glove box won't open. The customer said he even tried to pry it open but it still would not open. The customer was pressing the glove box lock instead of the button to open the glove box. This truck was brought in as the customer says he just rebuilt the transmission and now the speedometer does not work. The shop declined to do any work on this truck as the frame was pretty rusty. Customer states that when he depressed the brake pedal and presses the unlock button on the key a loud beeping noise is heard. Somebody had pulled a prank on the customer and had this four prong trailer plug connected to a horn and plugged into the trailer connector. This vehicle was driven in with no coolant as the customer says they have a coolant leak. The customer said he apparently had a tow truck slash roadside repair business do this so called repair to the thermostat housing. The technician who shared this clip said this person often comes to his shop with the hood open in hopes to get free diagnosis at his shop. This car was towed in as the customer said he fell asleep behind the wheel while smoking and the interior caught on fire. The customer also wanted the damage covered under warranty. The damage was not covered under warranty and the customer's insurance company wrote off the car. Customer states the check engine light just turned on. The customer had lost the gas cap and used a sock instead, but that caused an evap leak and the check engine light to turn on. This car was brought in as the customer says they have a noise in the front end. The technician found a subframe bolt to be broken and another one nowhere to be found. He also mentioned that the customer declined repairs and every other time he has brought in his car, he declines repairs and never fixes the issue. Customer states he can't remove the trailer hitch. Only the pin was stuck but the customer had cut the pin and hitch to try and remove it himself. It took some time but the shop got the pin and hitch removed. You can submit clips that you personally filmed on our website at justrolledinyt.com. I hope you enjoyed this video and please consider leaving a like or subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.